Asanin ng sanggali sa Buwanga City at sa lahat ng at mga kababayan na mga Chabacano. Congratulations po sa inyong lahat. Kasi talagang hindi na mapipigilan kahit anong gawin ng mga kalaban na nababayaran na tutuntun ng ating mga asama. Yan ang sinasabi ko na kailang Pinagampanan sa YouTube channel na siya ay isang teacher at siya ay talagang uh, kumbaga, gumaganap sa spiritual aspect. No? Ang galing niya uh, manalita at akala niya doon siya makikilala. Ang hindi niya alam, nilagay niya ang sarili niya sa kanyang um, pinatawag na kalalakya. Ibig sabihin, sa panahon ngayon, magkakaiba na. Kaya nga, ito'y paraan para maintindihan ninyo. Ang buhay may hangganan. Ang buhay may katuturan lamang kapag gamitin sa magandang paraan. Ito, sabi ko nga sa inyo, kung maraming nagdadasal na mamamatay na ako, So sa iyo ngayon, Kuya Michael, sana ang dasal nila ay mabuhay ka ng maganda at kaaya-aya sa mata ng iba. At sana, bigyan ka pa ng Diyos Ama ng mahabang buhay para pagsisihan ang pagkakamaling ginawa mo para sirain at hamakin ang buhay at ang tinatayuan. ni Queen Helen at Kira Chaka. Ito ay hindi akin, kundi ang nasa likod ko. Espiritual ka. Dapat tingnan mo ang gabay ko. Ang gabay mo sino? Yan ang mga dapat titingnan ng mga marunang kumatagi. Oo, kailangan natin maging sikat sa mundo. Pero, pilihin mo ang iyong inakasake. Kaya mo bang ipagsahan ang ginawa? Dipensahan ang ginawa mo. Kaya mo bang panitigan ang ginawa mo? Kaya mo bang harapin ako? Kasi lahat ito may paraan si Queen. Pero hindi ako ikatulad ng iba. Ako pinibigyan nila ng chansa. Michael Acera. No? Acera, whatever your name. na nandiyadyaan sa inyo. Ibig sabihin, lahat na marunong maghak, lahat na marunong manira, lahat ng detractors na talagang kayang sirain ang YouTube, ang Facebook, ang Prime Media. Marunos dito kayo. Kasi, ang nakita ninyo is only the tip of the iceberg. Last July 3, 
alam ko na nabayaran ka kasi yun ang na, nakalagay sa iyong whereabouts that pwede kang gumawa ng isang publicidad na aayon sa gusto ng kliyente mo. So, anong gawin ko? Anong isipin ko kung ako ikaw? Diba? Bayad? Okay. Diba? Sa pananalita? Bayad? Now, if you can defend that in front of me, di mas maganda, pero pag hindi mo yan nagawa, marami akong anghel, marami akong delagwardya, marami akong lulu, na inkantado. Sinabi ko na nga sa iyo, divine government, divino gobyerno. Yan ang pagkakaiba natin. Iba ang pumasok sa iyo, iba ang nakaluklok sa akin. Sumagkaiba ang ating lantas. Pero kung ikaw ay sumama sa akin at magbago sa iyong pananalita, welcome to the fold. Now nakita mo, marami talaga akong followers, Kuya Michael. Hindi lamang dito at sa buong mundo yan. Kaya ang ginawa mo, mas lalo ako nakilala dahil ikaw at ako. Anong magawa mo? This is not anymore my own doing. Ikaw mismo ang nagbigay ng comparativeness sa ating dalawa at sa mga grupo mo at kung sino man yung nagbayad sa iyo. This is the real truth. Kaya nga sabi ko sa inyo, lahat ng ginagalawan ko, may angkop na hustusa. Pero yan, pinapasa Diyos na kita, alam mo ba yun kahapon pa? Ang dami kong ginagawa, totoo yung deklarasyon na yan. Totoo yung ginawa ko. At this nation is the greatest nation on earth because I have done my assignment. Hindi lang iyan ang makikita ninyo sa sunod pa na panahon. Ako, I am just telling you that I am doing in the most legitimate pattern in fixing our land. Kaya nga, you have not realized that it could be your downfall. It could be your last in the YouTube. Dahil meron ngang batas eh. At iyan ay kayang bigyan. Kahit hindi ako na dahil meron mga tao na ka-assign para mag-implementa ng batas ng sovereign niya. You have been saying many things that is against the law. May royal decree tayo. 1-0 na kung sinong magkasala ay dapat parusahan. Ilabas natin yan. Mamaya makikita mo. Kaya ikaw ang Apple of the Eye ko ngayon dito sa live broadcast na ito. Marami ako nakalabas sa YouTube na mukha ko mismo. Hindi lang yung panahon ng July 3. Now, kung naingit ka at hindi kita naimbitahan, sana nagsabi ka na lang. Pero ngayon marami na kakakilala sa iyo. Mas marami ka na ngayong fans. Pero ang pagbantay, meron nang nakapigay. Kaya nga, hindi ako ang sinaktan mo. Ang mga tao naniniwala sa mission na ito. Kaya nga, panahon ng bagong generasyon. E kung ayaw mo sumama doon, dapat kumalis ka sa lupang pangako. Kasi ang ginagawa mo ay pagpapako sa mga tao pinili para sa implementasyon ng divino gobyerno. Pinakita mo lang na ikaw ay hindi sa divino gobyerno kundi kay paning na gobyerno. Yan. Klarado po yan, Kuya Michael. Klarado. Kaya nga, sabi ko sa inyo, God will always find a way to defend ng ginawa niya sa pamamalakan sa akin. Alam mo ba niya ang budget para sa bagong studio ni Queen ay mas malaki pa sa iba? At daan mo yan? 
What I am doing is only a skeleton. A skeleton lang ito na magaganap at mangyayari sa bagong generasyon. Kaya nga, the new generation will be the most benefit na marilisig. Beneficial na para sa kanila. Kaya nga, tama rin lang na ako'y nagsalita kahapon ka agad. Tinong ako ba yun? Di minura ka ba itong ako? Patulad ni Harada, hindi na mura ka balit. Pabuti na lang hindi ako magmunong magmura. It is my gift. It is my time. It is my truth. Na kaya kailangan bilang isang ina to tell to the whole world that we need to proclaim para maitu and install rectificatory form of government. Remember this from September 16, 2022, up to September 16, 2023. The sovereign judges of the sovereign court. From now, July, August, September, Islamic United Kingdom of Sudan, in Rome, Romania, hereby proclaim and install the global financial consortium for the recovery and rehabilitation program of all the global assets and properties, heritage accounts, cash deposits in all private banks all over the world, as administered ikaw yun sa lahat? O sino ang kasama mo? Sino yung nagbayad sa inyo? Sa inyo? Marami na ngayon lumabas at marami na report sa akin. That means this is a unified world now. This is a global peace. But since you have retracted what you have said, as they say, ituloy mo. Pero kung ito ay tuluyan, lumaban, you are against the time. For the global treaty, peace, defense, economic development, healthcare, and learning program, and renewable energy. This is the document that will be moved and that will power the entire world to bring what we have in this country, the Open Islands. Sulu and North Borneo, up to Malaysia, up to Brunei, all the Salem nations must come and unite with us. Ambassador Dion, as I told you, the key is the key. The key is gone. The key is unlocked. No one can benefit these assets, these properties, the zero one, the score, without him, without our ancestors. They molded me to be the one to fight for everyone of you. Many claims, many tried.
you are here, you yourself can attest within yourself why you are here. Because each one of you is called to help me get what belongs to us. I am fighting because the properties and houses, all this oil, all this deuterium belongs to the sovereignty, predecessor of law 101. When you say sovereignty, miles of God, Air, water, fire, the soil, and the cold, and the lightning, all of this is part of the sovereignty. Make yourself, do not breathe, you die. Make yourself, do not step on this soil. But each and every one of you belongs to the sovereignty, the ownership of God, and I am here now to really make this happen at all costs, because I have no choice but to do it. This document will be sent to our door. Many of you are all financial experts, Exodus. I have created the Imperial Federation of Farmers and Fishermen, and it is ongoing. It is scattered all over the Philippines now, because really my target is 100 corporations to serve each and every one of you. If you claim, you must have a village. And each and every one of you, we have leaders here who traveled from Mindanao, even took the boat that we are doing for how many days, Jane Cathedral and Alma. And I am so lucky, being the Raja Sulaiman, my own brother, Sultan Kayulawan Pandala Pasangalan is here. Because from the day that I have started my mission in August 26, 2010, I have been already fighting for the cause of us. No one can dream we are passing to the true blood of our gentlemen. No one can take and drill Sulu waters without passing to the Sultan of Sulu. No one can do also in Palawan without passing to the royal family of Palawan. To Manau, as you can see, the conspiracy is still going on. But I am here to stop it. Just recently, I challenged the government of Malaysia that in Sabah, they are housing a claimant. And I told them, if they will continue to climb, then ask the queen, as validated by our elders in Philippines, I have one here, Sultan Eduardo de la Cruz. Ama Ali, the living witness, the brother of Tunku Abdurrahman Patrol House, Jamalun Kiran, Jamalun Alam, Hasan Pasan, the side of the mother of my Jamal. And now the living witness is with me, the one who tasked me to break the wall of conspiracy. That's why even in my sleep, I am working because I am just a medium. I am just being used by them. How could I do this if I just have to do it on my own? If I just have to rely on my own personal powers, but because I am with God, I will face everyone, whoever you are. Because we have the power. We have the authority. We have our own elders to vote for me, to stand for me. Anywhere in the world, prima for shame.
I can fight because she is alive. Also, I can fight the climbers because the one holding the seal of the United Nations is also alive. We call him Elder Zero One, who holds the key. That's why I am telling my brother here, give me the money, the seed money. I have been operating in a zero support from our government. And I am really very disappointed because each and every one of them has been blocking me. What else they got? Killing, land grabbing, all this conspiracy because they want to stay in power. If you want to serve the poor, go out from this greed of power and money. Serve the poor. Walk with me in the valleys and the terrain of the war-torn territory of Pindana, of Sulu, of Lanao. They are here. Sultan Nasheed is here, trying to prove to the world that stop making manipulations in the land. Of Why are they doing this? It's because of our oil. It's because of our deterioration. That's why they want to take over the territory by stirring extreme fear. Who is then a terrorist? Are these people, are the Sudan the terrorist? No. I can vote for them. I am a Christian by heart. I am an ex-Dominican. I stand for truth and I will die for truth. And I will always fight for truth. If you can just imagine. This vital proclamation is the only way. Is the only way that we can unite. They have been searching the queen for many years. They have been searching me because they knew they cannot do otherwise. I was telling my brothers that came earlier, I had a meeting with them. They are just here. They are here. They don't even understand who I am. But now for sure, you will understand the power of our enchanted kingdom. Recently, the military suffered terribly. They are keeping this because the power of the enchanted is now moving. And I am warning them, Mindanao will rise into the face of the earth as the promised land. The water lily is coming back again. That is my sign. Whoever trying to ruin and destroy Iguazu Christ, the water lily goes up to Kirini Bridge in Kokabata City. That is the signal where everyone must know that the queen is moving. This is not an ordinary mission. I myself ran away for eight years because I really do not want to be a queen and I had been running to find a cross path to the Sultan of Sulu. That's why I told them, whoever would like to take the Sultan, go ahead. That was before, but now over my dead body. Thank you, Raja. <laughs> Love can be developed. Love is a day-to-day -day process. I have learned to love my people. Why can't I love the Sultan who is with me day and night? But the sacrifice, being a Malaysian, is really very difficult. But in the process, I have learned what it is to be destined to marry the grandson of Sulu the grandson of Malaysia and Brunei up to Kalimantan. The grandson of Sulu has been looking by the road 
back because of the blockage of his own brother. The brother contesting the throne, using even the family to really maliciously harass even my morals. But thanks be to God, thanks to Allah, because when the day that Ama Ali told me to find him in Malaysia, in Brunei, I challenged the old man and I say, I am sorry. If he really exists and you have the power, then let your grandson find me. Because I have been running away. I have made my deployment as a nurse in Saudi Arabia, just trying to get away from him. And fortunately, Destiny is destiny. I cannot fight my destiny. So I hope to face the reality that after eight years of running away, I came face to face with him. And that was really an impossible dream. <laughs> Just imagine, Raja Mamai was also running away from Malaysia because the ancestors also advised him to go to the Philippines because he will never come out in Malaysia. He will never come out in Sabah because his contesting contender to the throne is as high as Kota Kinabalu and that is his own brother. And that is the one up to now in conspiracy with all this ARMM, this, you know, bunch of more than However, I challenge even the president of the Philippines, go ahead, where are you going to get the money? You have no money. Malaysia has no money either. The rest of the world is suffering now with the inflation. Am I right, my dear brother? Because if you will not help me, it's okay. But the condition of our elders, we will take back all the backups and all the central banks. And that is the advice that I have to rush, move fast, because I am now the front liner of the elders of the financial team. To shout it to the world, Philippines, is the greatest nation. No. Everyone of you trying to see me just like this. And I told them, you have been this land of war. I am born really as victim as I am now. But my power is high as above. Because right now, they are seeking for the queen for something that is very important in the financial world. That's why this one, this is only a small proclamation. But with this, I will be again making the royal decrees one of family. The royal decrees 101 102, 103, 104, and the 105 is all a step-by-step -step process towards the recovery of all things. The redemption process in 2013, that's why they made the Sabbath standard. After which, they wanted me as the foreign collateral damage together with the king. We were in war in Sabah. We were there trying to stop the claimants that that is not the way to get Sabah. Besides, you are not claimants. We are heirs and successors. That is the greatest difference. The difference is they are claiming and here I am in the Raja, the world is coming to me. 
You don't only know how I work day and night. That's why sometimes I just have to put my eyelid like this because I have no more time to sleep trying to talk to the farmers in each country. Have I revealed this? No, because I know if I have revealed this a long time ago, I am the target of the sniper every day. You see, it still pays off to be there. It still pays off that I go out, take the motorbike, take the tricycle, or sometimes I just walk, and they would always fear me like this. But I would just have to say hi. But of course, if you are with the poor, do I have to wear all these glamorous dresses? I have to be with my poor, so I dress up like the poor. And I thank those detractors that I have for telling me that the poor queen wears the ukai ukai. And I really told them, you don't only know that the ukai ukai is for everyone nowadays. You see, sometimes they will attack you in the most demeaning way. But because I am stronger enough to face each and everyone who really assassinated me in character, my dear brothers, but with you now in front of me, I really thank because my brothers and sisters in China, my royal family, and I'd like to acknowledge Princess Michael for me. She's been sent by a royal family from China. Thank you for coming over. I have been working. I have been working so hard to capture the brains of China. That's why I told Brighton, you have a lot of assets. But I have a lot of good, hard, rich, wealthy people to serve my nation. And I am waiting for them because I have a lot of grudges already. Of course, I will not just have to say this, but I have already listed huge volumes of grudges enough for our nation. So I would like to request our people, you leaders, please let our poor people enlighten them, educate them that I am not here just to give and give. At least you have also to consider how could I serve you if I myself cannot survive anymore. People think I have a lot of money. They cannot only understand that I am also crying when the day that I have to find my source, my ways and means. But thanks be to God, thank you, Sister Sally and the sisters, for making this birthday of mine so memorable. And I thank each one of you for coming over, and most are still on the boat. Some are on the bus right now and really trying to come because they need to submit their budget proposals, all their documents, because I told them, I want you to have your feasibility studies so that I would know where to put the money and that is the legitimate way of process. So, I would like to say this in Tagalog, my apology. Maraming mahal ang sabi. Mahalin natin ang sabi ng natin. Huwag niyong papayaan na ang ating mga kapatid, mga kababatihan, inaalipusta ng ibang bayan. I want the OFW back soon. And I have a big project to that. Marawi, Bangon, Marawi. There are already the national team signified to support you. IFF India is blessed. Foundations are coming over to alliances. This is how we are going to do it. I'm going to talk. I'm going to talk 
each and every one of you because the blessings are coming. Kahit anong gawin nila, the blessings is like a flowing river. No one can stop it because it's from Him. Those of you that are inside the financial system and like the reorganization done because they themselves cannot do it anymore. We need a new team to do this. I have FMP is being requested by my elders in China to sit with them. Because what they are going to do we will release the money and put it here and put it back for them to distribute So the Queen's mission in the economic development is for radical needs. For hospitals, for education, it is also
I am just showing to you that those people that supported me have turned against me, but they are well documented. You can see their faces. You can see all their proof and evidences that they have submitted. But, sige lang, kahit sila ay lumayo sa atin, pinapakita ko lang na nandiyadyaan ang ebidensya dahil ang ating gagawin ay siyempre pagbabago. Marami po, maraming nasa tabi natin uh, umaalis dahil mas pinili nilang lumayo dahil alam nila na talagang walang-wala tayo. Pero sa ngayon, ngayong birthday natin ay iba. Kahit atakihin tayo ng lahat, may pagkakataon na talo pa rin sila. This is mainly my point of reference na pinapakita ko sa inyo. Yung mga videos, yung mga paraan, this was taken four years ago. Kaya nga talagang may dokumento tayo, may pruweba tayo, na kahit magtalikod sila, meron tayong dahilan para yakapin ang mga taong kanilang isinumiti sa atin, their territorial domain. Kaya nga, ang leader mawawala, pero ang taong nasasakupan ay magpahanggang kailan ay kasama sa programa. But if they will come back in the real essence of really service to the poor, then so be it. Kaya nga sabi ko sa inyo, lahat ito may pagkakataon na kailangan i-rectify. I am talking about rectification. Kaya nga lahat ito nakikita ninyo na merong dahilan tayo para magserbido sa tao. Ayan, nakikita niyo yung mukha na yan. Oh. Ayan, oh. Ayan, sino yan? That is Jane Cathedral. Kaya nga, lahat sila. No, andiyan din si Kaka Eduardo de la Cruz. Iyan, talagang namatay na iyan. O oh, ayan. Yan ang taong na nag-aano ngayon. Kasi hindi nila alam na madokumento sila. Ayan si Sultan Nasif. Lahat iyan. No, so sana makita nila kung gaano ka tatag. Ayan, talagang kunin niyo yan, mukha niyan. Kaya nga ngayon pinapakita ko sa inyo kung gaano kasakit pero panalo tayo. They can go uh, otherwise dahil nga siyempre naniwala din sila sa bang. Ayan, si Eduardo de la Cruz. Dinala ko pa yan sa Mindanao. Lahat yan sila. So, how many years back? Dapat tapos na tayo. Si Bay, lahat kayo. No, Sukran Katir. Ayan, si Eduardo. Nandito siya noong birthday ko four years ago. Kaya nga sabi ko sa inyo, dokumentado, pero nasaan? Hello, princess. Lahat ito, pinapakita ko lang sa inyo ang kahalagahan ng pagsama-sama dapat. Pero nawala sila kasi meron silang sariling agenda. Pero yung nasa atin ay atin, yung kinuha nila na sa kanila, bahala na sila. Pero tayong lahat, meron tayong pruweba kung paano gagawin lahat. Kaya, ang aking pakiusap, ito, nire-replay ko lahat ang ating programa para makita nyo na noon pa, ay eh, talagang meron na akong uh, physical evidences na talagang I do the mission in the premise of legalities. Kaya, hindi lamang yan party-party. Uh, yan o, oh, ebidensya ng mga taong tumalikod sa akin. Kaya nga, ito, kitang-kita natin. Kaya inaantay natin na mas marami pang mangyari sa susunod na mga araw. Maraming maraming salamat po at tuloy-tuloy uh, po ang ating pahayag sa ating mga programang ito. Kaya nga, lahat ito makikita natin kung sino sila at kung papano naging masalimuot ang programa dahil siyempre sa mga taong Iba ang kanilang iniisip kundi yung sarili-sarili nilang interest. Kaya tayo ngayon, pasalamat tayo na nakaka-diretso tayo 
sa ating ginagampanan. So, Queen is working always in the premise of legality. Kaya nga, sabi nga nila, o oh, nagpapaparty, okay lang yon, Kasi hindi nila akalain na noon pa man nakaplatada na ang ating programa. Maraming maraming salamat sa inyong mga nakikinig dyan. Kasi ito patunay lamang na meron na tayong ginampanan noon pa man. Meron tayong mga uh, legalidad na proklamasyon noon pa man. This is 2018, kaya nga 4 years ago. So pinapalabas ko lang ang ating mga previous bago nangyari ang July 3 noong uh, uh, nitong 2022. Kaya nga, napakaganda isipin dahil talagang nandyadyaan kayo lahat. Lahat kayong mga nakikinig, lahat kayong mga nakakagawa ng ano. By Sagira, magpakatatag ka, continue. So, oh, Princess May, Princess Lorena. So, lahat. Oo. Kaya nga, sabi ko doon sa mga tumalikod, congratulations din sa inyo. Kasi ako, may proweba, may ebidensya na para natin ipakita na kayo ay kailangan bumalik sa tamang landas. Pasensyahan po kayo, dokumentado po tayo. Hindi ako magsalita kung wala akong ebidensya. Ito pinapakita ko lang para we will rectify the future of our movement. Yan ang ibig sabihin yan. Kaya napakagandang isipin na meron tayong paraan kung paano gagawin ang ating mga ginagalawan. Kahit baliktad iyan ang, uh, ang paglalagay ng kamera, pero sa susunod na mga araw, mas maganda yung ating mga tinatawag na memories of the past. Kaya dito, simplified lang ang aking movement. Thank you so much, kasi kahit papano, nakikita ninyo na talagang meron tayong gabay, meron tayong plataforma, at meron tayong ginagalawan. Yan. Salamat Michael. Salamat kakapokan. Nakikita ko kayo. Ito'y isang paraan na na makikilala ninyo ang totoong serbisyo publiko. Ayan. Uh, si Sultana Maj. Uh, talagang nandyadyaan na yan noon pa. Kaya nga ngayon, yung aking voice alam natin na talagang uh, uh, meron pa siyang uh, mga kuan kasi siyempre sa signal so nawala pero uh, mamamaya yan ma, ma ano natin madiretso at uh, ma magawaan ng magandang uh, uh, boses para makita ulit sa buong mundo ayan nakita ninyo nandyan si Jane Cathedral okay nakikita o maliit pa si Prince Cray o ayan si Nasheep andyan sila para ipakita sa inyo na sila ay mga kasama subalit nag-iba ng landas marami dyan kaya pasalamat ako sa mga taong talagang nag-stick with us no? so kasi siyempre sa kanila ang gusto nila kaagad ay uh, pera the color of the money hindi nila naintindihan na si Queen nag-operate ng walang suporta kahit saan okay, maraming salamat nandiyan sila Sister Sally nandiyan si Ate Nena no? so, nandiyan noon nakita nyo yan kung sino yung mga iyan para at least paintindihan ninyo na ito may paraan o ayan, si Kaka Eduardo kaya nga sabi ko sa inyo eh, si Cray maliit pa pero ngayon, binata na so, ibig sabihin lahat ng aking ginagalawan ay may ebidensya may programa hindi lamang yan party party kundi yan mga proklamasyon na ginawa ko sa peace defense economic development healthcare and learning program and renewable energy na yan mismo ay ang gaas ang juterium natin at ang um, mga kayamanan na dapat bawiin so there is a due process these are the legal movement that I have documented, sealed, 
and proclaim throughout the world. Kaya yung proklamasyon ng world peace ay may batayan. Merong dahilan at meron akong ebidensya. Kaya nga sabi ko doon sa kanina, ayun mapapa ano niyo mamaya, i-replay -re yung uh, ating uh, live na boses kasi na sapawan nitong ating uh, video. Kasi pinapakita ko lang doon sa mga detractors that we had been or book doing our program in the premise na meron tayong basihan. Kaya nga, ayaw ko na muli na makarinig no sana kasi ang dami kong ginagampanan. Okay, so lahat ito nakikita ninyo na meron tayong sariling ginaproblama. So lahat ito makita natin that is 2018 at uh, 19, 20, 21, 22. Kaya may magandang balita at iyan ay makikita ninyo sa susunod na mga kabanata. Ito pinapakita ko lang and uh, these are replayed, these are ano natin pero I'm doing it live para ma-explain ko sa inyo na ang aking kapanganakan ay may dahilan kung saan nalalagay ang mga decrees, ang mga proklamasyon na talagang mabibigat. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyo naway na sa mabuti kayong kalagayan hanggang sa muli marami pa tayong ilalabas sa buong mundo para makikilala nila ang totoong queen of the poor. Ibig sabihin, meron tayong mga uh, proklamasyon, uh, pronouncement na talagang mapapatunayan kasi kailangan kong ilabas para maintindihan ng buong mundo na sila ay naging kasama ko subalit nang dahil napunta sila sa kabilang grupo at iyan patunay buhay pa dyan si Kaka Eduardo namatay si Kaka Eduardo noong 2020 uh, Holy Thursday kaya ito malaking ebidensya ito dahil sila ang humarang para madelay ang ating programa so may mga kasama dyan sila mismo nandyan si Jane Cathedral So mga pruweba po iyan na para ipakita ko sa inyo na talagang sila ay kailangan bigyan ng tamang uh, advice kung ano ang gusto nila. Kung sila ay susunod sa atin o sila ay tuluyang mapunta sa kabilang daan. Kaya you can see 